Early last year, um, an idea came to me and we were very fortunate to be able to carry through this idea. Uh, we commissioned a piece specific for this concert, the first concert in that brand new space. I was able to approach Mr. Matuska about this and he was very supportive of the idea. Um, it worked out even better when a local composer and a area band director, um, I reached out to him and he said he would be more than happy to do it. I said it'd be great to have it in August and he added to me by March of last year. So the kids have seen this piece for a while um, and, have, and have, have enjoyed playing it and it's been a blast to put together. Um, I'm even more excited that Lane Powell, who is the previous Fillmore Central Band director and uh, an outstanding human being, is here tonight. Can we have Lane be recognized? So not only is it a ton of fun, but it's a little nerve wracking when the composer of the piece you're about to play is sitting right in front of you. So that's a lot of fun. Um, a huge thank you to Lane for writing this piece of music. Um, it was fun, I was sending recordings to him last week of hey, how's everything going? How's everything working out with this piece? And it's been great. His two main ideas when he created this piece um, were, the, were the first being celestial objects, so comets. And, um, and Lane wrote, and I really liked this, how they travel through the depths of time and space as moving energies, colors, sparkles, almost with a spiritual nature as part of the greater cosmos. The second idea being the celestial space of the new hall and tying in with new traditions and old traditions um, and the excellence of uh, our programs here at KM. So without further ado, here is Celestial Celebrations by Lane Powell.